How you doing, Miss Mama Doc? It's glad to be around you again. Hey, I'm glad you got me back. Took you long enough, too. What's going on? Bro? I'm cool, and it's good to see you. You know, I kind of want to jump right into it. I haven't seen you in a while. You know, your name is synonymous with one of the biggest drill artists to ever come out of Chicago. So I kind of want to know, like, how's life been since a lot of the stuff you've been going through and shit like that? Well, life has been very blessed for okay. me, truth. I ain't gonna even, you know, his life, birth to his teenage years, his struggles that got him to the point to where he was, where he wanted to change everything negative that he put out. Right. You know, because he saw the bigger picture and then his kids here for my kids. Right. Doug was a father, right? Yes, a right. four. Three boys, two girls. I'm one girl. He was a dad, mm -hmm. right? You know, a lot of people don't know. They just see the rap side of people. They don't know the, the family side and shit like that. You know, overnight, you done became the most famous mother in the drill culture. You think so? Yeah. I want to know, do that play on your mental health? Because with being a famous mom, that come comments from the fans, all in your business, making up stories and shit. Do that Any bother you? Any human born, I'm going to put it like this, anything that was meant to beat you in life, you didn't allow it to. Right. You know? Yeah, me, it's even passing on to my daughter. Right. She's getting bullied at school. Mm. You know, the kids are sending her the video of her brother um, saying mean things like what the fans be saying, what everybody's saying, but I don't even worry about them because karma ain't going to miss. Right. Same energy you put out, you definitely going to get it back. Right. That's the, the difference between me and other people. Right. So, like, the... The, the family members do recognize Duck was huge in the rap game and stuff like that. Yes. Right. Yes. I don't see him as much since he ain't been here. But right. You know, it's, yeah, they knew he was the one. They know he the one still. Imagine what it's I a I see. Dad. He got plaques and... Dead yeah. if he was still here. And everybody, if you ask my opinion, still die with them. Everybody that was in it, mm. which is weird to me, but hey. So you notice that the impact of drill didn't left. And I wouldn't just say my son, everybody who had an impact on the right. drill culture, they are no longer here. Did you see this happening though when they was first started rapping? Did you see that this some of this rap shit could get out of hand? I never seen it in a million years. Like honestly, I thought would have been my son the mass was late. Because that's why he made drug habits. I have to tell you. We gotta go to the doctor. You drink this stuff too much. The speculations where they say it. Um, right. And so I was real scared for him. Never in a million years that I thought. Is it hard, like, seeing things on the internet now, you know, the case is over with. Well, I guess, you know, you got the verdict. Is it hard still seeing, like, I blog about Duck, so other people blog about him. Do that, do that start to piss you off some? Is it to the we point where you When they lying, gonna... yeah, it pisses right. me off. Yeah, and especially if I have, like, a connection with a lot of bloggers, because I'm kind of cool with, yeah. you know, some of the bloggers that reported on Duck, and when they saying something wrong, I could be like, forget it, let them run with it. But mm -hmm. then, no, nah, we ain't gonna put, no. So I try to correct some of them, and then some of them, I just be like, oh my goodness, this just is ridiculous. Right. But never in a million years. Are you shocked that some of the fans make it seem like you shouldn't want justice for them? It do that throw you off a little bit? Yes, it do, Truth. I'm so glad you It throw me off, me too, Mama Doug. I got to be honest. Because what mother in the world wouldn't want justice for their son? Not to be bringing up other moms from that side, this side. It's a lot of moms that got justice. 
But because it's me, you know, they all, you know what I'm saying, they gonna run with. I have a lot of supporters, truth though. Give okay. me mom. Right. I have people every day give me my flowers while I'm here. You know what I'm saying? But then I have the fans. I think it's their relatives making fake pages. You know what I'm saying? Because the people that be coming at me with real pages, truth, I will go on their page. <laughs> And I see them pictures with their kids or they got R.I.P. somebody in their bio. I be mm -hmm. like, you will really troll a grievance mother's. Like, you don't think you got to face God's here. And that's what's wrong. It's a lot of God, non god fearing people out here. Uh. And I believe if they believed in fear God more than they fear men, right. we wouldn't have none of the discussion that's going on. Because baby. Ain't nobody arms long enough to box for God, and I just let him fight my battles for me. That's With okay. all I've been through, truth, like, they want me to be this crazy, sad. Even some of them think, <laughs> right. we ain't in the movies, baby. Like, it'd be right. funny sometimes, but if I listen to my head, ain't no telling what I do. But as long as I follow my heart, truth, and no vengeance is mad, said the Lord. I'm cool with that. I don't care how they come at me. I don't care what they say about me. They can't touch. That's just their opinion. I'll get you on that. You know, I kind of want to fast forward to, like, the first day you go in that courtroom. I'm a dog. You go in there. You finally see them in there. Was that, like, what was that the first time to be in that courtroom? and see the individuals who was responsible for this. I dreaded it that day, but I knew it had to happen. It was a big commotion because a lot of people were sitting in the front. There was a lot was, of people in there? Yeah, but they were like law students. Okay, oh. You know, they were law students and they were on that side. We were on the side where the jury was, but they were on the side where their family was, but and they had to remove a lot of the law students up out of there so the family can come in there. When me and Doug's dad got there, and I walked in that courtroom, as I'm getting off the elevator, Brody was recording me. As I was shy or whatever, but mm -hmm. he was recording me, and we kind of tight the corner. So kind of some of them were sitting in the hallway Oh. They went and told the sheriff that he took a video of them and they took his phone. To see. Yeah, they've been snitching since we got there. You know what I'm saying? Telling on us, thinking we taking their pictures. Baby, this is not that. I came here for one thing and that's to get justice for my boy. That's it. If you want to like not look over there? I, or... It was a problem when I was staying there. They couldn't take a stare truth. They telling the judge, the judge, they telling their lawyers, the lawyers is telling the judge, can y'all refrain from staring at the defendants? And I'm like, not these big bad jump out ass motherfuckers while the police a hundred feet away shoot somebody is worried about a stare. You know what I'm saying? They put Kenny Mac and Ralph in the front. The okay. best move they could have ever did. Because they was the clowns of the courtroom. The jury watching everything they doing. From threatening us, talking about they'll kill us, to Tal saying, I'm still breathing. No, I'm still, they doing all oh. this in front of the judge, in front of the, like, they was real calculated. The judge don't get control of that? They, I felt they kind of disrespected the judge. Like, uh, Kenny Mack's lawyer, he was so disrespectful, but he tried to call texts on the state. But while the lady is uh, testifying, he is throwing baskets in the uh, garbage can in the middle of the trial, right. shooting from the desk. But then had a problem with the state texting in their phone. And it was like, don't you see my client? Uh, and they are real, you know, he, like he was pulling a lot of texts. Like, don't you see my client? Uh, and they are real, you know, he, like he was pulling a lot of texts to the point he pissed me off so bad. That's why they ain't let me in the courtroom the last thing. I put Duck chain in my mouth because he was like, oh, Duck, wasn't, Duck didn't have as much money as them. Duck wasn't no King Von. And what do they got to do with these motherfuckers killing my kid? So if, it's, if you ask me, they lawyers is the reason they ass probably lost that trial. 
Ooh, I know you ain't say shit. Probably three sentences the whole fucking trial. He did a lot of objecting, you know. You know what I'm saying? A tall lawyer act like they looked like Aaron McFoods. Right. Both of them looking like twins, missing they ceiling at the top. They both looking. You know what I'm saying? I tried to speak to Kenny Mac lawyer after the uh, trial was over with, just to talk to her because she was a woman like, and she and I could see the sympathy in her face. Like, damn, this woman, and mm -hmm. I gotta defend this motherfucker. So I wanted to speak to her. But she was like, I can't talk. You know what I'm saying? And I respected that. Right. Who wouldn't be happy? It was cool for them to do a, a duck death party. But I'm really cool because I'm celebrating the justice for my son. All the blouse. Oh, I don't think nobody should be celebrating. So nobody should be celebrating okay, you nobody did see that. Right, you seen that, right? Nobody shouldn't be celebrating nobody death neither. But y'all hit y'all top y'all party for the last three months. Y'all was happy as hell. To the person that sent y'all dumb ass off why I done leaving here too. Cause I be having premonitions about my son a lot breath coming up out of him. And the way that boy mocked him and trolled him and did what he did. It was like Duck was telling him, nigga, you next. You feel what I'm saying? It was like, you laughing now, but you next, nigga. Because I really believe when people die, they see who coming next. They just can't warn us. You, you was in the courtroom. You, they, you actually had to sit in there and watch that video? Yeah. I seen it before the court. I seen it after the court. Like, and I was kind of glad that the world saw. Like. And I was kind of glad that the world mannerisms, who the tall, the height, the them jumping out the car on the same side, the other car going to their baby mamas getting on the stand. There's no way. And to try to sit up there and, and, and whoever on his page sending out that false ass information about move out coming home, they're gonna be a queen. never happened. It never happened. Maybe in 50 or 60 years or something. Right. When he advocate on what not to do in the streets. And don't be stupid because you're going to lose your family. You ain't going to be able to be around none of your loved ones. And as y'all can see, everybody that messed with him ain't even messing with him no more. That can't be life. And then you die. Yeah, that's tough there. Yeah. You know, I don't want this to come off as police or anything, Miss Mama. Jones. Come off as police. Mm -hmm. I don't care. They say I'm the police anyway. No, nah, I'm just. <laughs> did Doug know Teasy? He didn't know him or did From know a him? can of paint. He so ain't he know. know he never met Teasy. And that's what blew me when the open statements, the judge was, the, uh, his, his attorney was like, why would he want to hurt Carlton? He grew up with Carlton. Their parents was grew up, and I'm looking at this duck. I ain't never been on four six. Live nowhere on four six. I did. Right. When Duck was born in 1993, we stayed six twenty one East Thirty Seventh Street on the S curve. Only way Duck knew about four six because my cousin walked. That's why he ain't dead. Right. Lived in Ellis Town. All them knew Duck, but Duck didn't know him. And what's so crazy, like, before the bounty was put on his head, Duck used to mess with that girl for years. Why you wait to nap? Oh, so that wasn't nobody knew Duck was messing with? Oh. No. Duck probably started messing with her in about, like, 2017. And that bothered him. Yeah. But she wasn't with him since 2012, 2013. Oh. How's you tripping over a girl who don't even mess with you? So I ain't never finna believe that's the reason. Because, yeah, there's a lot of tender dick ass niggas out here. But that honey cake was the only reason. So, Mama Doug, you really you believe that honey cake? That's real. Ain't man. no question. Okay. Ain't no question. You a risk that for free? Downtown, Oak Street, police are right across the street. Who gonna do that for free? Who gonna risk that for nothing? Who wants somebody out the way that bad? You either proving your ups in the ranks or you're getting paid to do what you need.
that's, you know, last thing I kind of want to pinpoint on that. You know, news broke out there. It said somebody was on the phone with Dirk Brother D thing. Was that rumors on the internet? No, they showed it the FaceTime in the, in the snow. The closing arguments was the best because, you know, with the state opening, then the, um, the defense get to do theirs, but the state rebuttal and get the last say. And when I tell you when he did that, that was one of the pictures. Right. From the out, from, from the, how he put that shit together, like, hmm. Then he got to talking about, yeah, they want to say they OTF. What song C Murder got? What song Kitty Mac got? What song? Ain't they ass up in the last picture he showed was D Thang and Tall. D Thang faces clear as day on the face hand. Yeah. You know, you said something in the video after the trial. You know, I don't know if you was just, you know, at that moment, the feelings you had, but you kind of said that it was mean words tossed towards you at the end of that trial. Like, you can't see your son no more. At least we can see our people. Nah, you know? what was said, we was coming out the, and this one, Jasmine, turned around like, and you will never see them neither. Like, ain't no winners here. Somebody That's told you that for real? She, we walked, they walked behind us. This was the, the day that uh, Muwa Mama took off her shoes. This was the, the day that uh, Muwa Mama took off her shoes and was trying to fight us and we coming out the courtroom. She coming out the courtroom like this. In front of us, shooting at the ground. Right. They yeah. watching this though. So y'all fucked it up too. For them. You got Los Mana, baby mama. She, it's like 12 of us. 12 dogs. It's like 12. When I say dogs, I'm talking about eat them up, spit them out. Yeah. Me, my sisters, both of my sisters. Jasmine, it, it was some dogs. We would have ripped them. And then they had a baby with them. So they walking behind us like, huh, that boy ain't never coming back. I lost the truth. Right. Jasmine turned around like, ain't no winners here. You think they coming back from this? I say, my son gone. Yours finna be going through. And then they gonna be gone. So yeah, when uh, they escorted us out, we didn't get, you know what I'm saying, charged or nothing. Yeah, I was going through it. I took about weed in the federal behind. Mm -hmm. But we legal out here, though, so it's legal. Not in the federal building, oh, it ain't. Oh, right. Okay. It ain't federally legal. It's state legal, but... You it think they were trying to pick on you a little bit? No, 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 because I can honestly say if he could have cuffed it, he would have threw that shit away. Okay. I've been going there two, one and a half months. They ain't never had no problems at okay. all. But this particular morning, my head was everywhere, and I had like about two grams, probably a blunt of wood or something. Mm -hmm. Not even a lot. And when he opened my purse, now I got through the first, first magnet detector, you know they. Right. But as you going in the courtroom, they search your purse again. So oh. when he opened it, he seen it, but the other guard seen it too. Mm -hmm. So he was like, "Uh oh," and I'm like. So they do not but take me in the room, wrote me up a citation. Oh, okay. Then charged me. Okay, that's cool. Wrote me a citation, put me out the courtroom and said I gotta come back tomorrow. That's Gave cool. me my court date, which was December the eleventh. Mm -hmm. This was the day that we almost set the courtroom up. They showed, they were showing that video, a tall right. drop it up location. And my sister got up, you know, the one that always be with me with the dress. She right. got I up. I seen them. And she looked at them motherfuckers. She said, Your ass is done. Mm. Slap the wall. You would have thought somebody bust in the courtroom. Oh, no, you're not. We paid millions for this case. You're not going to call. Mm -hmm. And that's. That they didn't even let me in the courtroom doing the verdict. And I was okay with that. I was fine with it. Because I was looking at them, they couldn't see me. They squirming in the chair. 
they got their heads down there. But at first they were smiling, happy, looking at me. I'm looking at them back. Mm -hmm. yeah. When you get the verdict, are you like now at the point, you know, I got a couple more questions, that's it. Go ahead. You at the point now, are you satisfied? Or it's still don't, it's still I ain't gonna be satisfied to everybody in jail. Right. That's my goal. Everybody who fucked with them, who affiliated with them, who, yes, that's my main purpose. All of them need, because all of them was happy when he died. Wasn't they? But that's how that shit go, though, right? They mark each other's deaths and all this and that. But ain't nobody telling their mama to shut up. They got their voice. They can voice their choice. I mean, voice their opinion. They choose not to. I mean, voice their opinion. They choose not to. Mama, this because I'm quite sure we all did our best. You know what I'm saying? But for somebody to constantly dish your deceased loved ones after you done made a peace song and then constantly decease you, uh, you know, you looking like the whole, well, ain't we ain't fuck peace and all this. Now, everybody with the shit, they ain't affiliated because y'all done took that boy out. And now all that shit finna fall on y'all ass. So my satisfaction will come knowing that I know nobody else child will get shot down like that. At least not in the entertainment industry like because she happy every day. And I feel sorry for these parents. Yeah. Um, I think we can get an update on Brit. You know, there's rumors around the internet. That ain't no rumor. About Brit. Oh, well, not no rumor. Mm -mm. But they opened his case back oh, up. Oh, so they did? Yeah, the cold case people picked it up. Mm -hmm. And I'm I'm working on that now. I can't wait to, you know, one of the um, suspects that they were going to charge wind up dying. So that is true. Yeah, okay. they were trying to say that uh, Mac Macaville had something to do with it. Right. But I just don't knowing what the circumstances and honestly I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Because I just can't see. But anything is possible. You see what I'm saying? Like, police know more than us. And now you got people talking and witnesses coming forward. So, it's only a matter of time where they gonna lock the other two individuals that was on the head. So you do believe brick cases is gonna be solved? Yes, for sure. Right. And I think it's all connected. Yes. It go mm. way back. All of it. Yes. This shit get crazy, Miss Mama, dog. Uh, last thing I want to ask is new album. Just got a new album coming. I'm the highest coming to y'all. Uh, last thing I want to ask is new album. Just got a new album coming. To y'all, It's called what again? From the Heart. From the Heart. Uh, <laughs> from the Heart. Okay, that's what's up. <laughs> Why not? So you got some exclusive big Oh uh, man, I got all his features gonna be on there. Oh, that's dope. Uh, it's about time. They want it. I'm ready to give it to him. I had to go through a lot of legal legal measures. That's what I was gonna ask. Was it easy getting his music? No, I've I've, I've okay. always had it. Nobody didn't have his music. Even, not even the label he was so-called signed to. Okay. And what I couldn't understand, like, if y'all paying for studios and all this, why y'all don't got his music? He was dealing with Chris. He wasn't even messing with the label, whatever. You know what I'm saying? He just branched off with Chris. Okay. Right. Oh, oh, the legendary Chris K. Yes. Okay, yeah. They make good music together. Oh my goodness, they got. Yeah. Man, I can't wait. I'm making my business, and I'm I'm just we just a small little record label. BCE, shout out BCE. Okay, it's so done. still under BCE. Yes. Okay. Yes, it's they, getting dropped. He knew about booted. BCE too. That's something Big Cloud wanted to yes, do. Yes, that was oh. his. Right. His big brother just got illegal. Okay. 
You see what I'm saying? One Trey came out with the Big Cloud Records. Right. But he didn't legalize it. He didn't take the steps to make it a real LLC, a real right. record label. Michelle the Don did that with BCE. And mm -hmm. we got artists, baby. We got one artist, his name Rob. He be getting uh -huh. it. And we got Susie Bay, the Shout real out Susie fuck Bay, your baby know. daddy. <laughs> Y'all better stop playing yeah. with her. So yeah, we 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 we, we got a release date for Duck. Not yet. Okay. But it's coming soon, though. You think you know how many songs we get on that last project, Duckhead? I think he had like. 11 songs on there, I think, um, 11, 12. I'm trying to put 20 on this. Oh, we're going to get a lot of big crowd. Because it's so much. And okay. I'm trying to, like, do the album, then do some more mixtapes, and then... Oh, so we got more big crowd man, music. Oh. Man, stop playing with that boy. That's this dope. This time he was coming. Okay. And nice. I was going to make the mixtape this time coming for. Okay. That's going to be the mixtape, but the album going to be... Okay, the last thing I want to ask, Mama Duck, did the labels look out for you after Duck Fest? So no, you know, and it's still to this point, I don't. We don't get nothing off my son. Everybody that uploaded his stuff on right, Apple. his videos in a million. I stuff. uploaded stuff on Apple. Did like everybody got their hands in that boy pot? Right. Besides the rightful people, his family. You know what I'm saying? He has a whole estate. Right. Everybody that got. Millions of views off my. They don't say, huh, Mama Doug? Add this to the state. They say they bring a split sheets. Like, mm. I'm still waiting. Right. I got the paperwork. I got the seal. Right. A state letter. Right. Everything what that dropped me a million. It's your United. It's, I think, um, because the last thing that came to his estate was his United Master. Oh, so okay. Which was half, some of it was stolen. That's oh, another story. Right. But that was it. You know what I'm saying? I've really been taking care of my family off that bogus ass only thing. So I'm not going to even lie to Trace. Everything my son got or did will go to his kids because he had four of them. But he wasn't married. So that gives right. me the right. Right. Jasmine was his fiance. You know what I'm saying? So he just didn't get all before he could get all his affairs together. He was just kind of trusting the wrong people. And I don't get right, this. right. I right. think that part. Because I know I'm gonna talk my shit. Ain't nobody gonna shut me up. Right. I'm gonna say what I wanna say. Okay. And I'm gonna let the God deal with me if I see it something out of place. Okay. Which he ain't gonna let nothing come out of my mouth out of place, no way. What's that new YouTube channel? You got a new YouTube channel. Everybody Let's needs to subscribe to Mama no Duck ASAP. And my Instagram bio. They keep on okay. bullying Mama Duck on YouTube, y'all. I noticed. Y'all noticed my last channel didn't have number three. I wasn't even getting monetized or nothing. The one that, not my other channel that I was getting monetized off of. They stopped that. Then the new channel I made before I made this, I had three videos. I couldn't even go like live or nothing. I went, they sent me another email. Uh, we terminated your, you know, and I'm like, right. not a strike. Like, I don't know why YouTube on me. Yeah, that's wow. But we need everybody to subscribe to that. What is it again? Let's show you the week. It's in my bio. Okay. No it's space. It's in weekly. One it's, word. No, nah, it's got some letters behind okay. it. But just hit that link in my Instagram bio. What's the Instagram again? Brick and Duck. Oh, excuse me. Harper. Brick and Duck OG. That's mm -hmm. my Instagram. Y'all need to subscribe to that ASAP because Mama Doug got some new Big Clout music. Uh, she be updating stuff that's going on. So y'all need to stop right now. If you can't stop right now, subscribe to her YouTube channel. Click that link that's in the video. What's your social media? Again, one more time, Mama Duck, to make sure they get um, it. I'm Lou Shane on uh. Facebook. Brick and Duck OG on Instagram. Follow me on TikTok too, Miss Highly Favorite. Mm -hmm. Follow me on TikTok. Y'all get that TikTok bus. Mm, appreciate the opportunity to speak to you, Miss Mama Duck. All right. Keep up the good work. All right. Love <laughs>